Hello everybody, this is my second day of doing Zoom and uh, teaching from home, okay? Uh, I have some tips for you, wait till the end of the video, I'll tell you some things I learned from the first day and then ho I think today I'm probably gonna learn some more things, so stay tuned. Hi, good morning! Good morning, Miss Cora. Oh, you're so sweet. Good morning, good morning to you. Alright, Miss Corn, learn a new trick that I can put one person at a time on the screen. Mm, that's gonna be great when we're sharing, okay? Because then one person at a time will, will be big. A, B, C, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, E, F, G. It was fun, wasn't it? Yeah. That was a lot of fun. Alright, yeah. friends, so let's get the thing that starts with letter N, okay? And then we're gonna go one at a time. And we'll put it on the chart, okay? So can you see the chart? Yes, we can see the chart. Okay, now remember letter N, guys? It goes down, down, down. Let me see you do it in the air. Down, down, down. And little N, you're going to go down, come up on the elevator, and jump. Let me see you do it. Okay, and letter N says, mmm. So what you get? Netflix. Nail polish, like Luna. And I made a picture over here of the nail polish. So two people said nail polish. What nail, let me hear you guys say nail. Mm, necklace. Mm, necklace, you hear the mm. Good job. I have one more. You have one more? Can you tell us what it is? A nut. Ooh, a nut. Mm, that's something that you eat. So let me draw the nut. All right, very nice. Ah, you guys are so smart. Hold on, everybody kiss the brain. Ah, oh, kiss your brain, you're super smart, guys. All right, we're gonna review everything we have, okay? And, and pay attention that your mouth is going, mmm, net. Good job, ninja turtle. Ninja. I think we did all of them. Okay, now I'm gonna show you the cards. Let's see. These are Miss Corn's cards. Let's see if we got the things from the cards. Nose. Yes. Nose. What number is that? Nine. 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 Oh, we found we have number nine. All right. Very good, guys. Let's hear a hip hip hooray for this wonderful class that's so smart and knows everything. Hip hip hooray! <laughs> Hey, where did you come from? I came from school. I got into your stuff, Miss Core, because I wanted to. I miss the kids. I wanted to be in your class. Okay. Did anybody else come with you? Or you come by yourself? I think somebody else came with me. Hi, guys. <laughs> Is everybody there? Hello. I didn't want to be at school by myself. I miss you guys at school, so I came to Miss Corn's house to be in your class. Is that okay? Yes. Okay, now let Miss Corn find the little number thing. So I'm going to show you a picture. You're going to tell me how many, okay? How many do you see? So show me fingers. Are you showing me four fingers? You're smart. Yes. One, two, three, four. Here's number four. Let me see you do number four in the air. Go down, go like this, then go like that. That's number four. This is number five. Do you remember how we make number five? Make the neck, make the belly, put on the hat. Belly button, no, don't put the belly button. Don't put the belly buttons. Okay, I'm gonna give the homework for Monday. Write your name two times so you can show you your name when we come. I want you to bring me two things that has the shape of a square. This, this little dog's name is Happy. And Happy is going to sing the goodbye to everybody's song. Okay, we're going to say goodbye and we're going to finish today. Okay, have a great weekend. Goodbye, everybody. 
Goodbye, everybody. We're glad you came today. We'll see you on Monday. Stay safe. Okay, and do your packets. Bye-bye. All right, so I just finished my day two on Zoom. And I'm going to give you some tips, okay? One of the tips is the mute all button is your friend. Okay, that's tip number one. I know it's kind of rude. <laughs> I felt bad about it. But the best way is to mute everybody when you're talking and just unmute one person at a time and uh, just let them know I'm going to mute this person, that person, and then that person can come. Another thing I discovered today that I didn't do last time is that there is a speaker view. There's a gallery view and a speaker view. So on the gallery view, you see everybody that's on the chat. And on the speaker view, only the person that's talking come big on the screen, which is very good and very helpful. The only thing is when you're working with the little kids, you know how they say a little bit and then you always have to prompt a little bit like, mm-hmm, yes, what else? So every time I had to do that, then my face would come big on the screen and then, you know, so I guess we have to get used to it that the only way that they go big on the screen is when they're talking. If they get silent, then whatever the sound's coming from, it, what goes on the screen. And if you interrupt them, then you keep going on the screen. So that was a little bit frustrating for me because I wanted them to be like, uh, for instance, they were showing things that they, they got that started with the letter N. And then sometimes they would, I would unmute them and they wouldn't say anything. So then they wouldn't be coming into the screen. So I would say, okay, it says what it is. And then they would say one thing and then I, I had to prompt again and all that. So anyway, it's just, it's just things that I guess we have to get used to the new system. But all in all, I thought it was a good class. And you know, sometimes kids want to talk and they keep raising their hands. And it's, it's kind of like a classroom in a sense. Some things are easier to manage and some things are a little bit harder to, to manage. But it's just a matter of getting used to it. So those are um, my tips for you. And I hope you are enjoying your Zoom. Please share down what, how is it going for you? What's your experience with this? I know we're all learning something new and learning something new can be kind of scary and uh, defeating at times, but it can also be exciting. I'm excited I'm learning. I'm, I'm happy I got to see most of my kids uh, today again and you know got that connection with them. And hopefully I'm providing some normalcy in their lives and some emotional support. Of course, I wish I could do a lot more. And, but you know, you do, we do what we can with what we get, right? So let's keep moving, guys. Let's, let's keep moving, okay? We're teachers, you know what I mean? Whatever happens, we make it go, all right? So keep up the good work, guys, and let's, Let's keep doing it, all right? I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.